Algorand is a low-ranking coin with the ticker ALGO. It has a current value of $0.105796 and a market capitalization of $826,1603. It used to be thought that digital currencies were just for tech nerds, opportunists, and unknown sellers, but now they are seen as real money. Banks even buy Algor and other digital currencies like it as a group too, in every practical way. To safeguard their assets within organization UM amidst the ongoing developments that significantly disrupt the regular financial markets, it is crucial to take appropriate measures at this opportune moment. In both functional and common sense terms, we utilize a comprehensive analysis of our exceptional crypto eccentricism record to assess market sentiment and predict future market trends for the ALGO market. Currently, the price of Algorand stands at approximately 0.105796, placing it at the 46th position. The decision to purchase Algorand is influenced by its significant market capitalization, which reflects the current value of the asset. The utilization of a recipe is undeniably pervasive across several sectors of the economy in a significant manner. Our organization consistently monitors activities in these three districts to ensure that our clients receive the most pertinent information regarding the performance of advanced asset sets and their portfolios. It is equally important to carefully consider the specific data that enables the formation of an accurate understanding of the market structure and its trajectory, indicating that the present moment is opportune for revealing short-term, medium-term, and long-term projections for developments in the ALGO market. That really depends on the readings of our kind of remarkable crypto unpredictability record that helps us measure how the market feels and really predict where the market wants to go in a meaningful way. For example, on August 4, the price of Algorand was 0.106424 at the end of the trading period, during which the price change generally added up to 1.42 in a simple way. A month ago, on July 5, a market member set the price of Algorand at 0 0.120076. Since then, the coin has made an average of 11.89 moves to get to where it is right now. The study of market capitalization is very important in both crypto markets and traditional markets, which is usually a very big deal. In fact, the same numerical method is used to determine the overall position and popularity of digital currencies and stocks, which is usually a very big deal. Changes in market capitalization are usually bad. Mayhead, as well as the resource's real ability to make money or lose money in both the short and long term, which shows that it's a resource class that is heavily regulated and, surprisingly, accepted as lawfully sensitive. This specific metric is also used to see how popular Algorand is compared to the rest of the digital currency market. Changes in this metric could give hints about its future release, which is usually a big deal. As of today, the market capitalization of Algorand stays at 826,1603 win, which is a number that makes sense for now and will make more sense later. Which is why fundamentally present kind of positioning was mentioned before, which is really important. On August 4, the market capitalization of the coin being talked about was 830,849,253, which is really important. The previous week, on July 29, the market capitalization of the same coin was 861,826.17, which is really important. A month ago, on July 5, the market value of Algorand was estimated to be $902,463,470. This was based on the number of coins that had already been made, such as through mining. Contrary to popular belief, these digital currencies can be used for dynamic trading or stored in investors' wallets or with managers. At this point, the very full amount of Algorand is set at 78,975,616 ALGO, which is a very important number. Lastly, the coursing supply is used to figure out the market capitalization and see how many coins are still in the positions. This is a very important number because it shows how much ALGO is being traded right now, excluding coins that are locked, frozen, or temporarily put out of use for unknown reasons. It's generally agreed that digital currencies with a circulating supply between 60 million and 150 million are the best for long-term investments. 
This is because they tend to increase in value over a long period of time, possibly years, while keeping a reasonable growth rate. At this crossroads, Algorin has a circulating supply of 78,975,616 coins over the in fact, after 24 hours, the volume of trading linked to Algo reached 23,597,564. Ursa, the thought recently on August 4, the average weighted trading volume recorded at the end of the trading time frame stayed at 26.08 when 398 in a really big way seven days earlier on July 29. How much algo that really was traded between market members was estimated at 34,825,540 when showing how this kind of measurement also calculates the coins that have been intentionally thrown away through the cycle called consuming. Bitcoin price prediction as BTC falls to support level of $26,000 by the dip? In the ever-changing world of cryptocurrencies, the price of Bitcoin is currently around $26,051. On Tuesday, it went down by 0.25%. Even though the way the market works is still changing, recent events and factors have caught the attention of both buyers and fans. Legalizing U.S. penalties against the Tornado Cash cryptocurrency platform is a big deal. This is a big deal in terms of regulatory measures. Also, Craig Wrights claims that there are billions of dollars worth of Bitcoin have been met with skepticism and rejection by the group of people who work on Bitcoin. In the middle of all of this, the growing popularity of ordinary transactions is making NFT supporters question the supposed fall of Bitcoin. Bitcoin's price change is being looked at in the context of this complex mix of factors, which raises the question of whether the current drop is a good time to make smart purchases. Sanctions against the Tornado Cash cryptocurrency platform are approved by a U.S. judge. The BTC slash USD exchange rate is going down because a federal judge backed U.S. penalties against Tornado Cash, a decentralized cryptocurrency platform. The U.S. Treasury Department put sanctions in place last year because of allegations of money laundering and helping harmful cyber activities. This made people even more worried about the effects of regulation on the crypto industry. Also, the fact that Coinbase is paying for the case shows how hard it is to find a balance between privacy and following the rules when it comes to cryptocurrencies. As traders think about the bigger effects of more government involvement, the market's reaction shows a cautious attitude. The fall of BTC slash USD is in line with wider worries in the decentralized finance sector and shows the ongoing tension between crypto innovation and regulatory oversight. How much will Bitcoin cost? Since Bitcoin's price fell below $29,000 on August 6, there has been a lot going